Hey what's up guys welcome to the super tech show Today I'm going to tell you how to overclock your graphics card With overclocking you can make your graphics card perform at its utmost edge And what it's not actually meant to perform but it actually does You know for those instances for you guys Games not working those daggy frames I think overclocking might be what you just want to pump up your gaming performance. For this, you're going to need MSI Afterburner. So it's, it's probably one of the best tools out there to overclock your graphics card. It's, uh, it's actually better than the, the software provided by AMD, the Catalyst Studio, um, Catalyst Control Center, in which there is a uh, utility to overclock. But I don't think Nvidia does provide anything. But so you still do have an MSI. I think that's the best. So for that, you're gonna download MSI from here to this page. You go to downloads and download Afterburner. So I'll link I'll put this link in the description below so you can test it out. You can also download Combuster. Combuster is a benchmark kind of tool. So if you over overclock and you can test. If, if that if your overclock actually worked so I'm gonna open MSI for now yes so here uh, here's my graphics card I've overclocked it too this is the D4 GT 730 with 2 gigabytes of DDR DDDR5 memory so the core clock I've overclocked plus 110 um, what, 110 ah, whatever memory clock also I pumped it 210 you don't want to play with the core board voltage or the power limit because you know it just kind of burned down your PC so you just don't want to do that so just tweak with these things around to get the optimal performance pump it up by five 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 and you could use combustor or run any graphic intensive thing to test if you see any artifacts they're just little things flashing on your screen or your screen changes random crazy colors or you see a graphics driver not responding thing you could just lower it by five and then test it again and when you reach that sweet spot you just do it click on apply and then save it a pro save some profile that I got and I don't have any profiles currently you could just you know one harsh one medium one low you just do that and then you're just done that's it just overclock your graphics card you're surely gonna see some I mean some performance boost and see don't overclock much because that may damage your graphics card it may just Increase the temperature to crazy amounts and uh, kind of melt down yet. Oh well, that's not gonna happen actually. Yeah, but there are some YouTube videos if you see a melting graphic card. So, whatever, thanks for watching. Don't forget to drop a like, subscribe to watch more, and thank you for watching. I'll surely catch you in the next one.